I'm just kidding, guys. That's just for the thumbnail. So we're going to find out what the traditional way of eating surströming is. Am I saying that right? Surströming. Surströming from Sweden. <laughs> I have never had this, but, you know, many people have been talking about this. So let's check it out. The traditional Swedish way of eating surströming. <laughs> I've heard someone cough already. Okay, so this video... Before we start this video, let me read the description. It's it's from a channel called Mighty Mag and it says, This is a short instructional video on how to eat stroming, fermented herring. It's basically fermented fish and there is basically there are basically two ways of eating fermented herring, on or off, white thin bread. The ingredients we're using here is butter, stroming, red onion, tomatoes, potatoes, white thin bread, and creme fraiche, fraiche, I don't know how to say that, with onions and tomatoes. Okay, um, that's optional, and with that, we're drinking beer and vodka. <laughs> okay, don't be afraid to try it. The smell and taste is very different from each other, okay? I made this video for my friend Ken Aito in Japan. Okay, this is for Reddit apparently. So I hope it's okay. I'm reacting to it. Let's go. Smart is butter. How is he saying it? Surströmingen. 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 Did I say that right? Surströmingen. Svensk man potatis. Potatis. Vanlig potatis, helt enkelt. Potatis. Vodka. Svensk snaps. Ett absolut tillbehör. Och öl. Och då kan man antingen ta... Those potatoes look like they, they just came out of the ground. Det är en special röra som... Tomato, creme fraiche. Creme fraiche. Oh, that's how you. S oh, creme fraiche. Of course, of course, creme fraiche. Wow, I feel so dumb now. Creme fraiche. It's that I haven't. I had never seen it written down. So it's creme fraiche. Yeah, but I've heard of it. Okay, let's see. People are laughing in the background. Let's see what what's gonna happen. Oh, this is the moment they open it. I've heard that opening it, you can't open it indoors because the smell is overwhelming, overbearing. I really want to try it. You know, I I really want to try it. But somebody in the comments said, stay away from the surströming. Surströming. Somebody said that. Stay away from it. <laughs> but I, I feel like it's something that people might love and people might hate. Oh, he has the liquid on his hand. No reaction with the smell? Oh, one fell off. Surströmming. Somebody said... Wait. Some say surströmming, some say surströmming. What's what's the real one? Surströmming, surströmming. Ah, oh, that is nice bread. Look at that. Very flat bread. Hmm? Is this the equivalent of like an American barbecue, but a Swedish barbecue? They don't seem phased by the, the smell. At all. Wait, are the potatoes like ready already? A little potatoes, a extra extra onions. Nobody's going for the Wait a second. That's the first thing they. Uh, never mind. They were going. The first thing they got was the tomatoes. I was. I 
thought nobody was getting the, the tomatoes, but nah, I was mistaken. I mean the tomatoes with the creme fresh. Oh, what is coming out of that fish? Are those guts? Okay, so this is the traditional way of eating it. Do you eat the tail? Do you eat the skin? Do you eat the guts? Okay, he's taking the skin out. But nobody seems phased by the smell. I think people on the internet just exaggerate about the smell and the taste. Some people say it's delicious. I think it's just like anchovies. Oh, there are so many bones. There's so many bones, bro. Is she making a cream out of it? Is that what she said? Yo, one thing I'm noticing is that there are so many flies. One just landed on her flatbread, but are there these many flies in Sweden? Because here in the UK, I don't... Well, wait, there are so many flies here as well in the summertime. But I, I, I would think, you know, that Sweden is like very cold, that there are no flies ever. And she doesn't seem bothered that the fly landed like three times on her bread. She's just eating it anyway. What's the other side of the table eating? That looks like butter chicken. I'm getting hungry now. Guys, you want me to try this? Surströming? Where do I find it? Because I, I also heard that you can't import or export surströming because of the smell. And it's hard to conserve, something like that. So, it, it, is it illegal to transport and export? <laughs> Yo, she is making a huge falafel. <laughs> so you can eat it on or off the flatbread. This is very different for me. I've never had it, uh, a dish like this before. It's, it's like a fish falafel. <laughs> oh, and he eats the flatbread just... okay. I think I might have done it the way she's doing it. Like, kind of like a sandwich, a flatbread sandwich or something. But he's eating it, like, every ingredient separately. Mm. Yo, doesn't this video feel at home? Like, you know, it, it just feels like a, a re like you're there with the family, like a family afternoon. Let's see. It does look like it's delicious, though. Why do people say, you know, that it's 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 bitter or sour or something? I think it's like Marmite. Either you love it or you hate it. I've never had Marmite either. This looks like it's a nice afternoon. A very nice afternoon with the family. 
Oh, that's nice. Oh, I thought the... Oh, uh -huh. it is over. Wait. Potata. Yeah. Cheers. Kampai Nippon. Kampai Nippon. This is so wholesome, and you know what's funny is that this is like a family homemade video, um, but I don't think they ever expected that their video would get 5.2 million views, and that a reactor, somebody random in the act in the internet, would just react to their video. Wow, you know I like this video. I really do. It 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 made me feel welcome it made me feel like i'm part of their family you know just joining in that is so nice i feel like you know um i would really enjoy an afternoon in sweden you know having some surströming i hope i'm saying that right guys the question is do you like surströming is it all that people say it is is it too strong do you like it or do you not like it is it similar to caviar like i don't know enlighten me and let me know your your side of the 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 team are you team yes surströming or are you team no surströming let me know in the comments and i'll see you on the next video guys let me know what i should react to next thank you for watching take care bye bye now you can get full access to exclusive content special reactions to shows series anime full movies and even request a video of your choice just become a youtube member or join buy me a coffee today find out more the link is in the description never break always fight never quit do it right the game.